Welcome to How To with Hand Cooked Tire, where we teach you the fundamentals of driving and tire maintenance. I'm Dean. And I'm Caitlin. And we know that changing a tire can be a little bit daunting for some, and only 40% of Americans actually know how to change a tire. So we thought it'd be a great idea to take it through step by step. First things first is you're gonna to wanna to pull off to the side of the road in a safe area, avoiding any oncoming traffic and make sure you're out of harm's way. So we're pulled over, we're safe, what's next? You wanna make sure that you put on your four-way hazard lights and apply the parking brake. Once that's all settled, go into your trunk and get out your spare tire. So what are some of the necessary tools we're gonna to need? Well, you'll need a spare tire, obviously. Besides that, you'll need a lug wrench and then a jack stand and its uh, assembling parts. Using the wheel wedge, you're gonna wanna uh, place that underneath the tire opposite of the one you're looking to replace. So in this instance, we're gonna be putting on the front left since we'll be changing the rear left tire. Next, you'll wanna position your jack stand underneath your car. Most cars have actual specific mounting points underneath it, so check your owner's manual and uh, be sure to identify those points. When the jack is in position, raise the vehicle until the flat tire is about six inches above the ground. Before doing so, you're going to want to break the resistance on each one of the lug nuts. This involves you taking the lug wrench and turning each lug bolt a quarter to a half of an inch turn, but be sure not to remove them completely. Next, you can get underneath the car. Uh, make sure you're not actually underneath the car, but right next to it, and um, jack up the car up to uh, full height, allowing for clearance underneath the tire. At this point, you can go ahead and use the lug wrench to remove each one of the bolts. It won't take much, so probably at a certain point you can go ahead and just hand uh, loosen them and remove them, but make sure you keep track of them, put them in a place so they won't roll off or you know, lose track of them because you'll need them in a second. Carefully remove the flat tire and place it out of the way, also being cautious of oncoming traffic. Next, you want to go ahead and grab that spare tire, then it should fit right in place nice and easy. Hand tighten down each one of the bolts and then you can proceed to lower the car. Once you've lowered the car, remove the jack stand and put it away. That's when you'll grab your lug wrench and uh, torque down each one of the bolts. You want to make sure that you clean up all of your tools and pack them back away underneath your trunk. Great, I think I know how to change a tire now. Awesome. 